I'm gonna make a little short quick video showing y'all how to uh, change the little plastic starter gear on a Briggs motor. I've had a lot of uh, lawnmowers I've been working on this summer that have come in and uh, the little plastic starter gear has either been broken or bust loose as I'm turning the engine over. I don't know why they designed them this way, but I'm fixing to show you how to replace it. Part itself costs about five bucks, a lot cheaper than getting a new starter. Alright, so for those of you who don't know, here's the starter itself. The little plastic gear is, goes here. That is what's broken off. You can get these. I got this at Advanced Auto Parts for like $4.99, $4.98, something like that. Um, you got three, or um, actually two bolts there that you have to undo. And then the power wire that comes from the battery. Make sure you have the key off while you're doing this or this will be live. So I'm going to fix and take these two, three bolts loose and then show y'all how to get this retaining clip off and put the new gear on. Alright, so I got this off. It was uh, two half inches and a 12 millimeter for mine. May not be that same on yours. I know a lot of them uses uh, Torx T30s. Uh, and unfortunately, I don't have my uh, stand to set this up while I do it so I'm not gonna be able to film while I take this clip off but if you see here there's like a little c-clip and there's a notch right here so what you do is you take a flathead screwdriver and you go in that notch up under this thing and lift up and it pops out of this groove and you can get all the rest of this off and slide your new uh, gear on so one thing you want to do if you have the old gear and it's not busted into a million pieces make sure the tooth count is the same this is a 16 tooth uh, majority of all plastic starter gears are 16 tooth but um, there may be a couple 14s so just make sure that's right because if not you'll just end up ruining the new plastic gear all right so i got the little retain clip off usually end up skinning some kind of finger knuckles whatever if there's an easier way to do that post it in the comments because all i know is to get in there and pry up on that so anyways just take this off spring off washer the u face is up Take the new one out. I really wish I'd have brought my stand for this camera. And they usually be written on the gear. It says this side up. If my phone will focus. Yeah, see this side up. So it'll go this way. Kind of sits down in the groove. Spring back. Washer back. Top back on. And then slide the C clip back into the groove and reinstall. I'm going to have to do this off camera because I need both my hands. Alright, so got it back on. Everything's secured with the new gear. And let's see what happens. I paid, paid 150 bucks from Facebook Marketplace for this. I probably could have talked them down a little bit more, but honestly 150 is not bad in today's market. So... I did verify that the battery was good before I bought it. So let's see what it does. <laughs> 